this is Mr. Stocker, and we are going to work on our exercises using the quarter notes and the quarter rests. We're going to do the first four at one tempo, then we're going to change tempos, and we're going to do the whole thing at a faster tempo. So we're going to start with one through four, and we're going to set our metronome to 80 beats per minute. So we're going to play along with one through four. We're going to pause after each one. Remember, Thumbs are on the flag, index finger on the opposite side, wrap these three fingers around. That's our fulcrum and our grip. So here we go with one, number one, exercise using quarter notes and quarter rests. One and two and three and four and Make sure that you're using the sticking policy that we worked on in band camp. We're going to do number two. Make sure we're also counting out loud. I'll count this one out loud the entire time. One and two and three and four and three and three and three and four and three and three and three and four and three and three and three and four and two and three and four and make sure you count all the way through the end, all the way through the rest. This is number three. One and two and three and four and three and four and three and four and and two and and two and three and four and. Notice that time once again I counted through the rest because that is most often when we will we'll make our mistake. Here is the last one I'm going to do at this tempo, number four. One and two and three and four and two and two and three and four and two and two and and two and three and four and two and two and three and four and now we're gonna turn our metronome up a little faster. We're gonna go where the quarter note equals one hundred beats per minute. This is going to be five through eight. Number five. Counting out loud. Make sure you're playing along. At home, you might want to be using your practice pad just so that way you can hear me play on your computer speakers. Here we go. Number five. One and two and three and four and. Notice how much faster that one is. Here's number six since we moved the tempo up. Number six. One and two and three and four and If you're playing on a snare drum, make sure you're using taps. If you're playing on a practice pad, you can use taps or you can try the full strokes. Number seven. One and two and three and four and Number eight. Last one at this tempo. Here we go. Number eight. One and two and three and four and Very tricky with the rest on that one. Now we're going to take the whole thing at a faster tempo. I'm going to play one through eight. I'm not going to stop in between. So I'm going to go right from number one to number two. We're going to segue. So we're going to go all the way down the page, non-stop. The tempo is 120 beats per minute. Here we go. Starting with one, all the way through eight, non-stop. One and two and three and four and Number two. Number three. Two. Number four. Number five. 
number five. Number six. Number seven. Number eight. Now, if you have a metronome, you can try all of those slower. Any tempo in between, plus you could also go faster than 120 beats per minute. The metronome just help us, helps us keep the time, helps us kind of push ourselves a little bit. Metronome, that was just my phone with an app on it, or else you can also buy a metronome. But if you have a phone or any kind of iOS device, Android, you can easily get metronomes for them. You can get free ones as well, as well as ones that you have to pay maybe, I think I might have paid $4 for that. So hopefully that was helpful. This is Mr. Stockert, and we will see you tomorrow.